And I stand here before you as living proof of that American dream. Howard Schultz, who has taken Starbucks from its humble beginnings to a global brand, said he will step down as the company's CEO in April. <laughs> Schultz will remain chairman of Starbucks, but hand over the role of CEO to Kevin Johnson, the company's current chief operating officer. Schultz's next effort will be to build high-end coffee shops that will charge as much as $12 a cup. Starbucks's move toward high-end coffee is aimed at refreshing its brand. The company has been facing increasing competition from specialty roasters such as Stumptown and Intelligentsia. Dunkin' Donuts has also been introducing more drinks, such as cold brewed coffee. While Starbucks continues to outperform the broader food retail industry, its sales growth has slowed in recent quarters. Opening high-end coffee shops marks the company's biggest strategic change in two decades. Schultz was encouraged in part by the strong sales performance of the company's first high-end shop, the Starbucks Reserve Roastery and Tasting Room in Seattle. There, coffee is roasted and then brewed using a variety of methods by top baristas. $12 gets you a cup of small batch coffee, brewed using a process involving a siphon. Starbucks is planning to open 20 to 30 more high-end shops, including one in Shanghai next year that will be twice the size of the Seattle store. But analysts say if the economy weakens, investors won't be so keen on Starbucks spending roughly $100 million a year building fancy new stores that may draw a few customers.